Hello YouTube, let Playmaker 1010 for free is back for the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princesses Walkthrough Part 36. Okay then, now it's time to go and find the Mirror of Twilight. And there is something I'm going to want to explain as well about what I'm going to do in these next couple of parts, but I will tell you afterwards, as in towards the end of the video, so stay tuned. The Mirror Chamber. Wahoo! Mamma mia! <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five. Five? Sam! He was supposed to have died! Mortal Girl! Oh. Let's see. Wait, there's none over there. Three here and one there. Hey, Beastie! Come on. Follow me, Beastie. I know what to do. Why am I wasting my time? Even though I can be human link and fight them, sometimes it is quicker and easier to transform into wolf link. But in the end, just change back. I'm gonna grab myself a heart. Boom. And now time to spin! Along this big snake. Well, rock snake of course. Spin, 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 and that's that. Okay, I'm going to tell you now, a bit of an epic moment is about to happen. Well, I'm more like a lot of talking. And some areas are, are quite good as well, so yeah, I am going to talk it all. So, shut it up. For the moment. <clears throat> What? The mirror, it's been destroyed! Sorry, I took volume. Who, what the? Who's there? Ghosts? Huh? A dark entity lurks in the twilight. It howls an evil power. You who are guided by fate, you who possess the crest of the goddesses, hear us. At the command of the goddesses, we sages have guarded the mirror of twilight since ancient times. You seek it, but the mirror of twilight has been fragmented by mighty magic. That magic is a dark power that only he possesses. His name is... Ganondorf. He was a leader of a band of thieves who invaded Hyrule in the hopes of blah blah blah. <laughs> I missed it. He was known as the Demon Thief, an evil magic wielder known for his ruthlessness. But he was blind. In all of his fury and might, he was blinded from any danger, thus exposed and stooped and brought to justice, I think he said. Thank you. 
yet. By some divine prank, he too has been blessed with the chosen powers of the gods. <laughs> it's a demon! His eyes weren't even human anymore. He's dead. How can you kill a spirit? His abundant hatred for lust and power turned into pure malice. Or whatever. Perhaps that evil power has been passed on to Zant. He just figured out where Zant got his power. It's far too late. Only the true leader of the Twile can utterly destroy the Mirror of Twilight, so Zent can merely break it into pieces. Once broken by magic, the Mirror of Twilight became fragments which now lie hidden across the land of Hyrule. One is in the snowy mountain heights. One is in an ancient grove. And one is in the heavens. You have been sent by the goddess. You should be able to gather these three pieces. But you must pre be prepared for the dangerous power that resides within those fragments. Well, there you go. Well, there you have it. I've now got to go and collect the fragments of the Mirror of Twilight. Okay, I think I'll do my little explanation now. Um... What was I going to say? Oh crap! Oh, there we go, I remember now. Um, you know how I normally go back, uh, you know, uh, backtrack to, uh, areas before, um, moving on? Well, I decided not to do that this time because, honestly, these three, uh, fragments are going to go through the last dungeons that has items that you're going to need to get the remaining things in the game, like all the pieces of heart and to the P.O.s. I walked to the wrong place. So yeah, I'm just going to collect the remain. I'm going to do the remaining temples to get the in order to restore the Mirror of Twilight. Then I'm going to backtrack, which might be five videos in total. I apologize, but it's got to be done. Now then. There is one thing I want to do though in this video before I move on. I just want to grab one more piece of heart. Crap, I still need three. Later! This piece of heart revolved the sp involved the spinner. I wish a, I wish a pony was around. It'd be much faster and safer. And we're almost at ten, ten minutes as well. Just get rid of this monster because it'll just get in my way. There. Now then, I need some bombs. Well, I'm going to say something. One of my friends on YouTube, I can't say his uh, YouTube name because to me it's kind of hard, but... Well, what, how you say it, but, um, 
he asked me how do you uh, equip the uh, the hawk's eyes with the arrows in order to zoom. Even though I've already told him he said thanks so we get it, I'm just going to show you anyway. As you see there it says press Z for bow and arrow combo. So I just press Z. And there you go. Press plus to increase and minus to decrease. Or just do these here. Zoom in, zoom out. It's that simple. Now then. Honestly, this area around here, it's not that uh, hard to move on quickly. Spin her, please. Because of this. Whee! Now then, we're going to want to go up this wall right here. You might want to be quick, so the beast... Okay then. You're going to have to time your bees right as well to jump, otherwise you'll fall. See what I mean? You'd fall. I'll do it this time. And there you have it. That chest contains a piece of heart. I just need one more for a full heart container. I would like to grab that actually. Uh, I can get it along the way actually. So, time to walk. Where you're gonna want to go next is right here, the ca castle town. I know that because the first place you gotta go is up at the snowy mountain heights. But you first you have to gather some information. So the first place you want to go is Hyrule Castle. Yeah bugger. I don't really care. You stupid friggin' fool. I can't help singing with it. Go do hell, you pointy freak. <laughs> I love. Uh. Well, I don't think this is really necessary to go to Hyrule Castle. Well, Hyrule Castle Town to go down to where Telma is. But I'm going anyway. Crazy fangirls roll! Those crazy fangirls can actually be quite handy. You talk to them, they'll give you, they'll bring out free hearts. Then uh, they'll run away screaming. Uh, my rupees, yep, I'm good. I'm gonna give back a further two more bugs that I've gained in the last part. In the, well, in the last couple of parts. Yes, I have, my lady. I brought you some day flies, male and female. Fifty, please. Yes. Well, actually, now that I think about them, I might grab some things along the way in between going to temples, but not all of them. There is one place I'm going to want to go before moving on, and that's back to Karato Village and talking to the thick people about those donations. Now then. Right. Yeah. And we're almost at 15 minutes, but I don't care, I'm extending this video to 18 minutes. Tell us more! Oh! Oh my, if it isn't Link! You mean to tell if you've been, honey? Mercy, you have a... You have a... Hey, hey everyone, look, I can't talk! <laughs> I 
don't care. Now then, just give these people a good talk to. Now, you guys can talk to them if you want to. I'm not gonna. I bet you guys recognize who this guy is. It's Colin's father. So, uh, what you want to do is look at the map. Ashley uh, ventured the Snow Peaks Mountains and headed off. That red mark is where you go next. Screw these people. And look over there, it's the postman! You can talk to if you want to, but he's not literally going to talk to you back. Okay then. Honestly, you have to go back to Krato Village anyway, so... There's not really much of a choice, otherwise you can't move on. But before that, go and speak to Ashley. I'm only doing that because I'm bored. Now then, we want to go down, down, down. Okay, let's transform back. Why? Because I feel like it. Ashley is in this direction. Snow Peak. The monster. Hey, your link, yeah? Oh my god, it's Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> Have you. I've heard great things about you. Telma looks out for me, so I stop by her bar pretty often. I'm Ashley. Anyway, what are you doing in a dangerous place like this? Ever since the Dormo Domain got covered in ice. Zoras, not Doras. <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> Stop talking to me. Really? A beast? As she said, you can't go without a plan. Okay then, let's just get ourselves to Krato Village. And I'll stop the video there. Okay then, uh, Thanks for watching, please comment and like, subscribe, and I guess I'll see you guys on part 37 of my Legend of Zelda Twilight Princesses walkthrough. Bye bye!